Now here comes the Mariners skipper out to the mound. And that will be all we see this afternoon of the Cy Young Award winner Felix Hernandez. Your attention, please. So he'll depart as now he couldn't quite Mariners, get that final out, but he will leave with the lead after a strong oh, eight and two thirds. Sun Juan O gets the call here as he'll try and look for one out to finish this thing off. Stepping in now, Josh Rutledge as he'll try to hold back on the swing, but he went around for the first strike. He's hitless in three at bats to this point. Ah, and that's cut on and missed, so now the Twins are down to their final strike here. And now this crowd of 27,000 plus rise to their feet. Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. I like the call for the two-strike change. Now a swing and a miss on a pitch that tied him up in knots, and the ball game is over. Man, they've already put the all-time winning streak record in their rearview mirrors. But with every win, it gets further and further away. We could say this now. This is one of the greatest teams in the history of baseball. 4-0 the score this afternoon. Felix Hernandez records win number 16 on the season as he struck out 13 in this one. So that just about does it for Harold Reynolds, Dan Plezak, and our crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way on over to theshownation.com. Our final line score this afternoon, first for the victorious Seattle Mariners. Four runs on 14 hits. No errors. They left seven men on base. For the Twins, no runs, six hits, no errors. They left seven men on base. Time of the ball game, two hours and 43 minutes. A reminder that extra post-game trains will be available at the King Street Station, located just north of Safeco Field. Metro Transit buses are also available at stations on First Avenue, Royal Brom Way, and Edgar Martinez Drive.